some firms have had an investment freeze, what are the signposts for them to lift the freeze? Um, so I think that I think th that's a great question, and it really gets to the core of kind of the technical difficulties that some private equity firms are facing when they're trying to execute some of the investments that they'd like to make because they're limited partners, these institutional investors, many of them are really scrambling for, for cash. And so think about it, if you're a university endowment, you're suddenly worried about all the, all, all the economic pressure that universities are facing. And so that you know, causes you to want to conserve capital and not want to provide it. So um, you know, I think funds are going to lift an investment free. I think these investment freezes will partly be lifted when we begin to see more clarity around what a reopening starts to look like. I think a lot of people are holding their breath because they, uh, they know there's going to be a resurgence of the virus. And, they don't know quite how we're going to organize our economic activity when because we don't know when that's going to occur relative to the development of various therapies and, and various you know medical responses to it so the interplay of those things is kind of is, is what's giving people pause and i i expect that when we start to have more clarity on that there's going to be competition among private equity firms to sort of be the first out of the gate to kind of get back in and make investment